What's going on guys? Welcome to Tech Life. Let's talk about how you should prepare for a coding bootcamp. Let's go inside. So if you are going to a bootcamp, you obviously probably know by now that they are very expensive. You know, probably on the cheap end, you're gonna pay $10,000 and up to maybe $20,000 on the expensive side. It's really important that you go there and you arrive with a solid foundation. That way you can get every little bit of knowledge out of that bootcamp. Instead of um, spending a lot of time learning the very, very basic things. If you're gonna to go to a boot camp, you should a few months before go online and start using a number of free resources so that you can build your knowledge on, on things like, at a minimum, I would say on HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. You don't have to become an expert or anything like that, but uh, at least have a solid understanding of how those three languages work. Some free resources that I would recommend are Codecademy or freecodecamp.com. Um, and there's some paid ones as well that are also very good. I've used uh, Team Treehouse, um, Udemy. I've never used Udemy, but I hear a lot of good things about them. Of course, there's always YouTube uh, that has tons of videos on how to learn how to code. Um, but I do like the structure of some of the other programs, like I said, like Code Academy and stuff like that. They take their time in building up the lessons. So if you really know nothing about coding, you don't have to feel intimidated at all about getting started with that. So before you get to your boot camp, go through some of these lessons and um, and arrive ready to ask some you know more in-depth questions instead of instead of just you know. What is a div? <laughs> um, I mean, and, and the reason I say that is, is you know, because because we are paying all this money up front, and there's so much of that knowledge that is just free online. I mean, don't go to a boot camp to ask what is a div when you can Google that and learn for free and so much more. All right, guys, I will see you at the next video. And if you haven't had a chance to hit that like button. Uh, please give me that thumbs up, uh, subscribe if you like these types of videos, and um, oh yeah, hit that notification bell so that you know the next time I put out a video. I will talk to you at the next one. Bye.